Can robot fuel melt steel beams? Donate to this Kickstarter and find out. Duel Japan's on and it's time to throw down. We're gonna need your help to upgrade the Mark II, put on the fight the world's been waiting for, and make history. You might remember last month, a team from Megabots Incorporated challenged a team of Japanese engineers to a giant robot battle because we live in the future, and the future is now. But now they've realized their robot, the Mark II, needs a little bit of upgrading because it's designed to fire projectiles, but not for melee combat, which is gonna be important. Kuratas, the Japanese robot that they designed, is uh, made for punching. And also, like, there's probably some lightsabers or energy blasts. We know there's a gun that you fire by smiling, so who knows what else they have. Be careful not to cause a shooting spree by smiling too much. So they've set up a Kickstarter hoping to raise half a million dollars, with their stretch goal being up to 1.5 million dollars. So this will pay for more melee weapons. The concept art features chainsaw arms, which is pretty badass. It'll also pay for better balancing algorithms and added safety measures for whoever's piloting this robot. Also, it'll pay for a brand new Hollywood-style paint job. So some of the perks to donating include some laptop stickers, a Mark II poster, a Megabots crew shirt, a 3D printed model of the Mark II, that's cool, and even a chance to come see a demo of the robot or even ride inside of it, which is cool. To actually ride in and test the robot, it'll cost, what, $5,000? Plus you have to sign a waiver that says you won't sue them if you get smashed by a robot. It's $5,000 and potentially your life, but so worth it. Team USA has also brought on a bunch of celebrity helpers like Grant Imahara from Mythbusters, Peter Diamandis, and the creators of BattleBots. Let's look at some comments. A lot of these comments are out for blood, it seems. Koala underscore steamed says, would be better if it were remote controlled or autonomous instead of manned. Not sure how much destruction there could be with people inside them. Louis Mel agrees. If we want some real fighting, get those ass out of the cockpit. Pen Click Productions also can't wait to rain on everyone's parade. I can't help but look at it and just see an altered tank. It's not anything like a mech or Gundam, just a tank. A pretty looking tank with a giant turret or cockpit. What do you want? It's giant robots fighting. At least some people are on board though. Luke Walking Moon Tree says, Dad Eagle shoulders though. Murko, 100%. Agreed. What do you guys think? Is American Muscle gonna trump Japan? Are you guys gonna donate to the Kickstarter? Let me know in the comments. My name is Whitney Moore. Like, comment, subscribe, share, kiss your computer, turn it into a robot.